Hey guys, today we're making up one of the easiest, most delicious chicken dishes you will ever have. Mouth-watering, melt-in-your-mouth, Parmesan mayo garlic chicken. Grab up some chicken, a few ingredients into the oven, you have yourself a fantastic, ever-so-delicious midweek meal. So let's make some up. So what I've got here are about 10 or 12 chicken tenders, and you can use chicken breast, thighs, whatever you like. So we're just going to throw these into a bowl. And you want a fairly decent-sized bowl here because we are going to pour in enough milk to completely cover those chicken thighs. You could also use buttermilk if you were so inclined and have some on hand, but I didn't. I'm kind of on a budget here. But what this does is it breaks down the chicken and makes it super tender. Oh, so yummy. So just kind of slush and slosh that chicken around into the milk and set it aside in the fridge for a few hours or overnight. Okay, let's make up our simple and easy coating, starting with about half a cup of mayo, depending on how much chicken you have. An equal amount of powdered Parmesan. Three cloves of pressed or minced garlic. You can also use powder as well. You know me, I'm a garlic freak. Followed by about a teaspoon of salt. Another couple of teaspoons of ground black pepper. Now you can throw in additional seasoning too. I'm just trying to keep it as simple as possible here. And a decent amount of fresh parsley. This is about, oh, I'd say a tablespoon. Grab up the old spoon and give it a good mixer upper. <laughs> oh my goodness, for a few ingredients, this does really smell good. And we'll just go ahead and set this aside. Okay, next up here, what you want to do is spray a casserole dish or an oven dish with some baking spray. Add in that chicken that's ever been so patiently soaking in that milk or buttermilk. And you want to drain enough of that liquid off so it's not too sloppy in the bottom of that dish. Then grab up whatever device you want to use, in my case a spoon, and just spoon that ever so delicious coating over top of that chicken. Of course then, I switch to two spoons just to make life a little bit easier. And you want to make sure you got a good amount of that coating just kind of plastered over top of that chicken because it does make it ever, ever so good. Okay, now we're going into a 375 degree preheated oven for about 40 minutes. After about 40 minutes, our chicken is done and it smells so good. And just look at this, my friends. Doesn't it look incredible? And when you pick this up, guys, it just looks fantastically, fabulously fantastical. Whatever that's supposed to mean, but it does look good. Onto a plate we go with those chicken tenders. And of course, you want to stack them high and mighty because they are going to get eaten up. Garnish with a bit more fresh parsley just to make them all pretty like. Serve them up with a side order of salad or potato wedges, whatever you wish. And there she be, our ever so easy mouth-watering Parmesan mayo garlic chicken. It doesn't get any better. And you bite into this and believe me guys, for a few ingredients it is just a flavor explosion and the chicken is so so tender and mouth-watering. You are absolutely going to love this, and it's a must-must-make. And as I say in every video, if you like what you saw, give us a like, because it really does help, and if you are so inclined, subscribe!